Okay then. Hello, hello. This is... 60 seconds re-atomized. It's basically just a port to the consoles. Uh... Right, okay. I've not did the tutorial. Scavenge supplies for your house. Make sure the fallout trailers will stop by end your run. No survival included. Okay. Uh let's do let's do the tutorial first. I'm just, I've I've like yeah, I've not touched this game as I usually do, I just go straight in. You get to experience everything with me. So one jug of water is four glasses. That can give everyone a drink. Oh, there's no music? Okay, there is. Hold the grab control. Just skip my words, but every time you do it, the reds will be... Huh? The yellow X. Okay, this control is kinda... dodgy. Great job, there might be hope for you. Yeah, just keep those legs moving. Okay. Where's the next yellow X? Uh, I don't know where the... It's not in here. Can you shut up? You know the drill, find the marked point in the living room, approach it with caution. Right, where now? Find your son Timmy ASAP. Timmy's gonna be in here, right? Nope, that's the wife. Uh... Timothy! There you are. They know layer your house. I bet you the reds know it too. Okay. Grab Timmy, he'll be the first in your cozy shelter. How do I grab? Okay, A. Let's like, start taking another family member to leave the exact priorities to you. Okay. Oh, I can't. Uh. Sup, can Okay. Right, so you have up to four items. Tammy takes up two. I imagine the daughter will take up three, as will the wife. She seems to be older than Timmy. Warball, warball, warball. Where are you? Are you there? God damn it, she's playing again. Where's this fucking warball? Yeah, I know I'll need it. I don't know where it is though, because I can't see the highlight. There it is. Got myself a problem. I gotta throw it in here now. Okay. Yep, I'm at the hatch. There. Oh wait. Do I need both ears for this? I may. Right. And now I need to grab more stuff. Right. No one knows how long you'll be staying down there, so you'll need a radio. Right. Cool. Nothing more useful than news from the radioactive outside world. Okay. Wow, the controls for us are dodgy. Right, how much do you take up? Oh no, two as well, okay. Flashlight would be good. Yeah, yeah. Water. Okay. 
Drop here. Come on. I don't know what that was, but... Shit. Am I dead? Okay. Right. So how do I, does it reset? It resets, okay. Oh, and you're starting me here. All right. Spammy. Okay. And you go. Wow, these controls are really dodgy. As much water as I can get. Wait, what? Okay, that's a map. That's actually good. I didn't know that was there. Sick. I don't know where the briefcase is, so just let me pick up this, please. Thank you. Throw you in. Get the gun. Move! And you go. What's that over there? Chess. Sure, why not? Get the water. Go get that med kit. And probably a, an item or two. I don't know what that is, so it's going in. I'm here. Okay. See you later, Dar. You're dead. All because of your annoying music. Shit. Should have thought about getting a gas mask. Oh well. Ah, surely there's a gas mask already down there. I mean, it's the Sheller. Congratulations, but the draw's not over yet. You'll end up here, whatever, whoever you brought with you. Nothing else. You need to make the most of it. T-shirts survive down here, but the world outside burns. Explore and interact with the surroundings. You can always find out useful things about your shelter and its inhabitants. Where survival journal is not opened yet or hidden. First things first, we'll ration food and water. If you don't wind it down yourself and the folks you brought with you, you can bet your bomb dollar and you'll see the light of day. Okay. Shit. Like everyone can eat and drink. Okay. Cool. Everything's all good then. Uh, it's ration again. Oh wait, here we go. Uh, expect an expedition a day before it actually departs. Uh, be careful though, tires of virus can never be a part of an expedition. Today we'll skip preparations and jump directly to summon someone brave outside. Ted is fine. Life is hard for all of us right now, but Dolores is in a good mood today. We hope it stays that way. Timmy's on his best behaviour. How long will it last? Who should go outside? Dolores will go outside, since she seems in a good mood. She's gonna die because there's no gas mask, but that's alright.
Uh, welcome back after a little while. I'm in event of real apocalypse. They'll be gone for a couple of days. In the meantime, you'll be faced with other problems. I'll test the limits. Uh, breaking the man's moral spine. We'll see what clay you're made of. But first, ration your food and water. We don't want anyone starving now, do we? The horse is on our way back to the, on our way to the surface. Let's hope she'll make it back safe and sound. Ted seems to do doing all right, even though the world's gotten a shizer. Nothing new to report on Timmy. He drew his mum, I think. Uh, you can have some food, Timmy. You can have some water. I'm an army man, so I don't know a single thing about imagination, but you could probably use yours now. Pitch the snare. You come across your kid's hamster, who in some bizarre way found its way to the shelter. The kids are obviously going to love it, and so will you. There's nothing better than food that comes to you on its own. Now it's up to you. Do you cook them? Yes, sir. Nom 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 nom. Yummy hamster. Good choice. Everyone had a bite. Fresh meat will not be as easy to come by in the days ahead. Best to take any chance you can get to eat. Believe me, you'll find yourself and your family in much worse scenarios than this. And there won't be a hamster around to save your ass. Ted is fine. No news. It's good news. There's nothing new going on with Timmy. Day four supplies. Timmy, you can have some food. Ted, you can drink a bit of water. You may be faced with decisions that require you to use your equipment. However, sometimes you might find you don't have the one item that was supposed to save the day. Make sure you scavenge the supplies before the blast. Keep in mind every item can be used for something. What do you want to do today? Clean a rifle, listen to the radio, maybe play shadow bunnies using your flashlight. Clean that rifle, boy. Right, Dolores is back. And she doesn't look happy. Oh, she's hurt herself. Good thinking, keep your weapons and working orders number one priority. Remember, even if they do get damaged, you might be able to repair them with some good old fashioned American engineering. Oh. Maybe some chewing gum and a shoelace. Morning, everyone, the expedition is back. Sometimes they'll return with extra supplies, sometimes they won't. Other times they'll come back with a nasty injury or even radiation sickness. Believe me, you don't want to get those. I hear glowing in the dark isn't as fun as it sounds. This time your explorer was hurt, but they will recover after the proper use of a first aid kit. You can use one during rationing. Dolores was hurt. She would love to eat something. Ted's fine. Timmy seems fine as much as can be in her current situation. She wants food. And she wants health. Uh, Ted, you drank yesterday so you get to eat. Timmy, you ate yesterday so you get to drink. You know, there's one alive adult to keep going. If you send your only spider to the surface, you won't know what's happening in your bunker until you get back. And when they do, your shelter may already belong to someone else. A decent padlock may protect it, but not for long. This was a busy day. Take your time and get some sleep. If you made it this far, you're doing great and have a chance of getting out of this fox. So hopefully soon, but don't quote me on that. Okay. She's healed up. Everyone seems fine. Other than the fly. Felice just sent someone outside, but let's give her another go today, shall we? First time you were only asked to pick one unlucky bastard, one brave volunteer to save the day. This time you also get a chance to equip your explorer with some useful gear. Feed your troops and I'll see you at the shelter entrance. Dolores has not eaten for a while. You ate yesterday! Dolores' wounds were patched up. Ted seems to be doing alright, even though the world has gone to shit. A crappy place. Despite the dire circumstances, we are all the trouble we are going through. Timmy is being very brave. You ate yesterday, you greedy motherfucker. You two can have war, Timmy can eat. What to take outside? We don't have anything. Right, okay, so suitcase would have been useful. Good to know. Ted, you're going out. Timmy's turn next. Okay. Morning. What's the plan of sitting in the atomic shelter? Why don't I just leave? We're leaving is a death sentence. If the radioactive sickness doesn't kill you, giant scorpions will. Uh, your one chance is our boys around to rescue you. So every good citizen needs to do one thing seek contact with the US military in a way to rescue. Ted left for the surface. We hope we'll be back. The Lord has not eaten for a while. Look the good scout he is. Timmy is making the best of the situation. He even seems cheerful. Okay, now you can have fucking food, alright? And you can drink. Rescue ain't come today, but we'll come and get you eventually. You need to keep your radio operational and be ready to venture into the wastes. However, you also need to be careful. It might not be our, only our soldiers out there. There could be bandits or worse, commies. 
Just imagine what will happen if the Reds discover you, so let's agree to the rules for the drill. You only open this door if someone knocks two times, am I clear? Two knocks. Okay. Uh, safely returned from his voyage. Metro station wasn't exactly abandoned, it's inhabited by a group that uses bullets as currency. They were armed and not overly friendly, but they're no bandits either. They allow us to take a look around as long as we don't touch any of their stuff. We went past any opportunity to get some more water, so when we found the toilets, we don't hesitate to fill as many balls as we could with that murky, irradiated liquid. What a treat! Dolores has not eaten for a while. Ted's stomach is rumbling. Timmy is on his best behaviour. How long will it last? Fucking hell, you ate yesterday, you greedy bee hatch. As long as you keep your shell stocked, you're good. Okay. I check the door. Maybe coming for you any day now, but be careful. It's supposed to look apocalyptic scenario, you never know what's coming. Ted's hungry. Dolores is getting greedy. Someone's at the door. Don't open the door. Good call. That wasn't the knock you were waiting for. Remember, be cautious. Uh, Ted's stomach is rumbling. Where is water when Ted's needs it? She's not eating. Is no longer thirsty. May not look like it, but he's a strong man boy. He's doing just fine. Okay. Uh, you're fine with water. Wait, are you? Right, no, Dolores needs food, she's not thirsty. Ted needs war. <sighs> oh, right, yeah. There you go. Alright, all we have is water from now on, Dolores. As you're counting imaginary sheep in your head and there's the knocks before your concentration. Two knocks, two knocks, the parent keeps repeating. Do you open the door? Yes. The end. So we're all good. Good job, you're saving some of their brave soldiers. Now we can all have some apple pie. You deserve it. We survived for 11 days. Atomic drill. Someone followed us. Underground. Successfully passed the drill. Cool.